Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Sky Factory 2.5. Welcome back to the island. Yes, uh, and there's some progress that I need to show you from the last time that we were together. And that's going to be the name of the game because we've got a lot of stuff to cover in this pack. So I'm going to be doing a decent amount off camera. I'll try and progress a little bit for you on camera, go off camera, and 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 kind of take what we did on screen and and just run with it. So from last time, the big change here is that we've got a little safety barrier. So that's going to help us. But we've also got something else right here. All right. So what you can do is you can take an apple and mix it with a, a sapling. And you get an apple sapling. Okay. So what we're going to do right here. So you see that? Apple saplings from Pam's Harvest Craft. I don't need to do that right now because I've already crafted two just so I could get this going. And then what will happen is these apples will grow. You can see that this one up in the Wayla is saying it's mature, so we can right click and pick that apple. Same thing here. Okay, there we go. And so what I've done over here is kind of expanded our island a bit, and we've got our apple area right here. The reason why I've got this separated from the rest of the trees is because I'm using vein miner to take out all these leaves, and I don't want to kill my apple saplings or my apple trees. So there we go. The other thing to show you is a mob farm that's not working. Uh, seems to be the name of the game. I'm just, uh, you know, I have failures in my single player vanilla and I'm having failures here. I don't know why this one's not working. It, anyway, it, it should. We can see that um, you know, that's a top top block or top yeah anyway let's hit f4 oh and a little skip there um, you can see that this area is spawnable and the light level is low enough that we should be able to get stuff spawning in it let's turn off the light level and another skip there for some odd reason from obs i don't know if you saw that sometimes it happens but if we go over here we are over 24 blocks away, which is enough room for mobs to start spawning in there. But I don't know. I don't know why. So we're going to have to redo that one. All right. The next thing is that... Oh, let's uh, let's take a look in the achievement book. Uh, we ha I've not done too much. Okay, so what I have done is collect some rainwater. It started raining and so I just threw out some barrels real quick. I did not bring you along for that. I'm sorry, but you know, when it rains, we got to take advantage. So I threw out a bunch of barrels. We collected a bunch of water and eventually we'll get some iron going and that's what we're going to be working on today. And then I can make an infinite water source and then don't have to worry about that. But there we go. Anything else? So I've grown a bunch of trees here. This one is not connected. That's fine. Um, what we're going to be doing now is the next part in our achievement book. We're going to make a crook and see if we can get some silkworms. And so I've got that right here. So we're going to have two crooks. And then also in the achievement book, we're going to, it says craft a hammer because we're going to be working towards some ore processing. So I'm going to make a wooden hammer right there. And what we can do is just say, all right, we've got the hammer and I'll show you how that all works in just a moment. So let's use the crook real quick and we'll vein miner this thing like so. And that gives us a silkworm. Good, good, good. So I want to get a few more. My goodness, okay, so they're not all connected. Oh, I see why, I see why. So it's a crook and it, um, it does not have tons of durability. So let's see if we can make another one real quick. And we'll do this. We'll make a couple like so. And we'll see what this does. Uh, vein miner, good, good. And did we get any more? No more. How about that? And this one? 
anymore. Okay, so we got oh, we got four. That's not too bad. And maybe what we do is just vein miner the rest of this stuff. Okay, and we'll get a bunch of saplings. And can I reach that? Is that possible? Is that a thing? No. Okay, well, you win some, you lose some. And let, let me just take care of this. Oh, I hate doing this stuff on camera because I want to make sure that we can get some more progress done. I'm going to leave that as is. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take this silkworm and I'm going to put it into that tree. So you can see in the Wayla it says infested leaves and that there is an infestation process going. What's going to happen is that this silkworm is going to turn all of these leaves into... Um, infested leaves and then we can get string out of it and so that's going to take a while so I figure in the meantime I will just finish clearing up the mess that I've created here and once that is fully done I will bring you back and we'll see about getting some string out of it all right all right so it looks like all of those trees are fully infested which just sounds wonderful, you know. I gotta, I gotta say, let's vein mine that. We get, ooh, hit E by accident. Ooh, got some more silkworms. That's cool. All right, so this one over here, do we get a bunch of string? How much string do we have? Okay, not quite enough. Not quite enough. So I need. Oh yeah, I got plenty. Okay, I did not see the stack right there. So we should be good for the next piece and what I'm gonna do is take care of this wood right here because we need to get some more trees going that's the name of the game it looks like based on what I've been seeing out and about on the interwebs for this sky block type stuff I've never done a sky block before so that's new to me let's put the silkworms away we'll pull out the saplings and I Looks like I can go harvest some more apples, but we'll leave that for now. And let's come over here and we'll put that away. And what we're going to do is make some mesh. Okay, and that is from... Oh, I didn't want to do that. What does that do? Woven cotton uses? Oh, okay. Well, we can make some armor from woven cotton. Okay, so all is not lost, but I didn't really want to do that. Let's throw this in here and this. And what we're going to do now is take a look at the, uh, what is it, the sieve. Come on, come on. There we go. Can we type? Okay. So we're going to do the oak sieve, and let's see if we've got all of that. Yes, we do. Oak sieve. Good, good. And then we'll grab some dirt. And what we're going to do here is maybe put it right here. And this is from the X Neolo mod as well. And we're just going to put a piece of dirt in here just to show you kind of what we're working towards. And that's in the achievement book as well. And we got three. Okay. So let's take a look. You can sieve or sift the dirt and get little stone pieces, and that gives us cobblestone, which we can then put down and run our hammer on. And that's going to give us gravel. And then we can sift gravel. And what does that give us? Let's see. Broken aluminum ore and coal. Very good. So what we're going to be doing pretty much for for quite some time is we're going to be sieving all of this dirt. Or sifting all of the dirt. Oh, that gave us, let's see, give us seeds. Very good. Carrot seeds, sugar cane seeds. Okay, melon seeds. Very good. All right, so I'm just going to be doing this. So we're going to be using the composter and making compost out of the saplings and and yeah this is what we're going to be doing for quite some time and eventually we will move on to making some uh, 
some lava, but I think that's going to be that's going to be in a future episode. We've still got a little ways ahead of us. Let's take a look at the achievement book real quick and just see where we've gotten to. So we've used the crook on the leaves to get the saplings and silkworm. We've done the infesting process there and we've gotten string from the infested leaves. Over here we've crafted a sieve, we've crafted cobblestone, and what we need to do now is try sifting sand and dust. So let's do that real quick. We'll make some cobblestone and we'll turn that into gravel like so and what we'll do is the uh, what is it the vein miner deal and so that gives us a bunch of gravel and we'll do the same thing with this cobblestone we're just gonna do this with all the cobblestone for now just so we can get some basic ore processing going and then We've seen what we can get out of gravel, so let's just do this, and we'll hammer the gravel to get some sand, and let me show you what we can get out of sand. I'm not entirely sure. So, uh, what, one more? Oh! Phone going off, so I'll get to that in just a moment. What did we get? I don't know what we got. Acacia seeds. Okay, let's throw all this stuff in just so we can see exactly what it is we're getting and And then we will hammer the sand in just a moment to get some dust. So let's do this Sardis quartz and crushed nickel ore interesting and Then we'll do this hammer this and we get some dust and can we can sift that as well okay what do we get out of this one do we get anything we didn't get anything out of that well anyway that's going to be the name of the game for now i'm going to take care of a lot of that uh, off camera so we've done the sifting um at this point uh make clay by putting dust into a water-filled barrel and that's that's where we're going to be getting to next let's just take a look at the crucible the crucible is going to allow us to make lava and to do that we have to burn burn an unfired crucible and to get one of those we need to make some porcelain clay which means we need some bone meal so i think between now and the next time i bring you back for this particular episode i'm going to redo that mob farm so we're going to build it out of wood and maybe I'll take it out further and take it up in the sky and you know we'll see if that helps us maybe get some some more spawning spaces I don't know we'll we'll figure that out off camera and I'll bring you back once we've got that going all right see you in a bit well, ladies and gentlemen we are back and let me just show you what I've done I figured out a new mob farm so we've got a platform up top it's seven wide and then eight on this side eight on that side and right in the middle is a two wide platform or two wide hole and there are what are they trap doors and so that kind of fools the mobs into thinking that they can just walk off the edge and so here we go we've got quite the setup here what kind of what kind of zombie is that i have no idea there's some oh boy it's it's kind of loud so let's get away from there anyway things have been working quite well and what you can do is you can actually take this rotten flesh from the zombies and put it into the composter like so there we go and we'll just fill this one up because zombie flesh is otherwise pointless so we've got a bunch of food see i've i've even expanded i've had to because we've got tons of stuff coming in from the mob farm things are progressing quite well we've got a couple of chance icosahedrons an ethos head which is kind of interesting world interaction upgrade that's going to be useful coming up some division sigils we'll take care of those later but we've got plenty of stuff coming in and if we look down here yeah so i've been doing the sifting thing even got some diamonds and if we take a look here you can see that i've gotten the hot topic so that is the furnace and then also, I killed a monster. That's because witches will drop and they'll, 
they'll stay around and then those warded zombies or special zombies will will stay around too so i managed to take care of those got some iron out of one of the sifted things i think it was from uh this one yeah so you can get some powdered iron ore so i smelted that and got some iron and i managed to get diamonds out of a chance bag so things are going pretty well you can see that we've got some mobs just hanging out there and they are rather loud well not the witch the witch is not loud and she keeps drinking her potion and i keep missing there we go got her and i got a new hat so there's there's a nice set of hats here oh another witch great is he going to go no anyway i'm wasting time so uh let's see the next order of business is over here i did get some bone meal out of that and so we can make porcelain clay and then what we can do is make an unfired crucible let's grab a little bit of wood uh let's see a couple pieces of that and then we'll chuck the unfired crucible into there and then that way we'll have a crucible that we can uh, start start making lava out of is he going to die no he is stubborn okay come on there we go finally we'll have to go collect all that stuff here soon too Okay, and I've, I've noticed I got a compressed witch at one point, and then once you kill a compressed mob, they make tons of the other mobs, or of that same thing. So there we go, we're picking up tons of drops. Eventually I will have to come in and make this a little more automated. But, you know, it works for now. We've got plenty of zombie flesh coming in, so we can make lots and lots of dirt and that's that's a good thing all right so that's all good and we'll fill this one up so this is going to be the name of the game for a little bit can we fill that one up yeah good 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 okay so we've got a crucible now and what you can do with those is uh let's see do we have a torch we got a torch right there but i need i need some other block so maybe we'll just put this okay and then we'll put a torch on top nope shift and then we'll put the crucible on top of that and let's see how that works there we go and then what you can do is put in some cobble do i have any cobble hmm no no cobble so I'll have to take care of that. Uh, so we'll we'll take a look at that in the next episode because I'm not going to have enough cobble to really showcase. But what we're working towards is eventually a cobblestone generator because that's going to get us the initial set of ores and then we can start working on automating this process right here because this is not the most fun. So do we got, uh, oh, got another, whose is this? Naukrian. I don't know who that is. So uh, perhaps that is my own um, ignorance. Well, of course it's ignorance, but uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know who Naukrian is. So there we go. Then we can put, okay, so let's see, solid volume. We'll just fill that up with cobble. And then that way we can start getting some lava eventually. And then we can set up our, our uh, cobblestone generator. But that'll be next time. So hopefully you have enjoyed this little look into how things are going on my Sky Factory. Let's come around. Oh, yeah. I have armor now. Got that out of, out of that mob farm. So, um, so yeah. Anyway. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, a like is always appreciated. And if you have not already done so, think about subscribing so you're up to date on everything going on on the channel. But that's going to be it for now. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.